All right, guys, out here today with uh, co-pilot Dave. We're just doing a little data gathering on the Mach-E. Get a lot of questions about uh, the EV. Um, sometimes when I'm out and about talking to some guys, and so I like that. If there's any questions you have about it, let me know. We'll try and do a video or answer it. But uh, I want to get a little insight on some of the um, things we use, the tools we use while having these out on an event like this to ensure you know that we're going to have enough charge to make it to the next point, hopefully. Uh, what we've got up here is, this is an app, a uh, phone app you can use with a um, OBD dongle to where you can get some data off the car's computer system. And the reason that's helpful on races like this uh, is because we really need to know the exact details of our consumption and essentially how much we have left in the tank, if you will. Uh, the car's systems do a pretty good job of that, but they're not 100% accurate, if you will, to some levels and accuracy is kind of key when you're pushing the thing uh, about as far as you can on range. So just kind of a view here, what we got going on, the voltage of the battery, 361 volts, amperage going into the battery currently with regen braking, 117 amps, and then the amount of kilowatt hours remaining in the battery down here in the bottom left at 60 kilowatts. So what we do when we're out on this event or when we're, um, you know, racing if you will not necessarily something you have to do on a daily basis while driving this car it takes care of itself pretty good when you're not pulling a trailer for the most part but we do watch what's left here in the battery 60 kilowatts and then the car is consuming about three kilowatts per mile times the two together and that's the effective range that you have at the moment so while we're doing the race we'll just be monitoring that and then we'll be plotting our trip to see if we can make it to the next checkpoint or the next charging station in our case. Um, you know, it's kind of no different in some ways than when you're hunting ethanol or you're hunting a unique fuel. Um, same difference, you're just looking for that charge station. But uh, have any questions, just uh, let us know and uh, we're happy to answer them or do some more informational videos on that.